Hi guys, it's Sandy P. Um, wanted to come on here just to, I got some mail today, wanted to show you what I got. And also, we just got back, my friend and I got back from a four day staycation in Flagstaff. I've never been to Flagstaff before and I had a great time. Didn't do any recording though, we took some pictures at the pool. The pool was incredible, there were like pine trees all around. Um, it was a pool and a hot tub. And it was amazing. They had a, a limit of 50 people that could be in the pool pool area at one time. There was never that many. So many times we went there and we were the only people there. Um, the restaurant that was on the um, on the property, you could do like takeout or they had room service. You couldn't eat in the restaurant. And so we had brought snacks with us. So if you're on my Facebook page, you may have seen some of our unusual meals we had um, my friend had gotten um, oh my gosh I'm trying to remember it was a it was a like a cheddar cheese with green hatch chili like a cheese sauce to dip it in um, we used it on she had also bought a thing of just like baby red potatoes and we cooked those in the microwave and we put that um, cheddar cheese with green hatch chili on it oh it's great and then she had some dill cheddar cheese curd um, that they had gotten from a dairy farm in Utah. So we had that. Um, she had, I don't remember, it was the name of a pickle, some, some pickles that she had bought at Costco and they tasted like homemade pickles. They were so good. And then we had cheese and crackers and peanut butter crackers and fruit snacks and we had some weird meals. But then we also ordered out from IHOP one night, which I forgot to take a picture of. And um, we ordered, because that night I wanted um, chicken tenders. We went to a place on National French Friday. We went to it Mama's Burgers. And we got cheeseburgers and fries and drinks. And we drove around um, Flagstaff. She showed me the NAU campus. And we went up to where Lowell's Observatory is but it was closed so you take the road up there and we just like look overlook the city which is pretty cool um, one night we ordered Cracker Barrel and they give you these really cute little bottles for syrup it was good but okay my cats are fighting um, but I discovered when we were in Flagstaff that I have that I get altitude sickness because it's over a mile um, above sea level I think it's like 7,000 feet. I don't remember the sign, but it's like second day there. I thought it was my vertigo, but I was so dizzy. Actually, it was a, we got there on Sunday. Monday, I was okay. Tuesday. Tuesday, I, I totally lost Tuesday um, because I was I was so dizzy. I couldn't do anything. Um, okay, my cats are fighting. Um, but then Wednesday, I was okay. And then when I went in the pool in the hot tub, perfectly fine. I would get out. I got a little bit dizzy. But anyway, we're home now. Um, I leave Wednesday to go back to Nebraska. It is Friday night right now. Um, I want to show you the mail I got. This mail came sometime. We were gone Sunday afternoon to Thursday afternoon. So the mail came sometime. I'm not for sure when. Um, first thing I got is this Variety Fun box. Uh, this is the last one that I'm getting. I may start it back up again when I get to Nebraska. Um, I don't know how this is going to be because I don't know which day it came and it was in our mailboxes. So it's been outside. I don't know when. If it came today, no problem. But you know, it might have come, you know, Monday. Okay. So I open up the box. I know you really can't see this, but I'm going to show you what's in there. You get this little paper, uh, special survey. I take the survey. Okay. And then I'm just going to pick this up. Well, pick this up and show you what's in here. Okay. See if you can, if this is going to work. See this? It comes with all sorts of chips and snacks. Oh, I'm going to show you. 
There's Harper. And there's Henley. Okay. Cute one. But anyway, this gives you snacks. So, like, part of it are the white cheddar popcorners, which are the best. I don't care what anybody tells you. These are the best. Um, I have some barbecue pop chips. Lays. Multiple bags of mini pretzels. Chesters, Cheetos, hot fries, whatever these are called. I don't like them. Um, Doritos. I know it's upside down. Another thing of Doritos. I saw something over here that I really like too. Okay. Crunchy Cheetos. Cheetos Puffs. And then there are multiple fruit roll-ups. There'll be different cookies. Cookies. White cheddar cheeses. Fruit snacks. Um, some grandma's cookies. More grandma's cookies. I'm just saying, sometimes they give you like crackers and stuff. Ah, oh, there they go. Okay, ooh. A fruit and nut granola bar. Cookies. And, yeah, see, sometimes they give you crackers too. So, it's basically this big box of snacks. Which is going to be nice because I told y'all I'm going to Nebraska. I'm going to be staying in a hotel. And, um,. I will pack some of this stuff in a bag because one of the things I'm going to do when I get there, when I first get there, is go to the grocery store and get hotel food. Um, I know I'll have friends who will take me out to eat or I'll go to their house to eat. And I know I'm going to go out at least one time, but try to get food to eat in the hotel. Okay. And then my other two things. Sorry, I've got stuff falling all around here. Um, packing up stuff. And... Okay. Both of these, this package, and this package, are both Lularo. Um, I have a friend who sells, or, sorry, she's a Lularo representative. And um, one thing that I've discovered since everything going on with um, Frank and then this COVID 19 and um, also losing my mom, my brother, you know, everything within a year that, um, my anxiety has caused sometimes the way certain clothes touch my skin. I just can't handle it. And one thing I've discovered is a LuLaRoe tank tops, which I have one on right now. Um, something about the way they fit, they don't bother my skin any. So my friend had said that she got some of these tank tops in. If any of you are interested in LuLaRoe, let me know and I will send you a link to her um, Facebook page. But I got these two. One of them is something I bought. And one of them is a gift that somebody got for me. I don't know which is which yet. When I open them up, I'll let you know. Okay, I think this first one is the one I bought. My, um, I'll tell you about the other one. Okay. Sorry, I opened up, I had opened up the package, but I hadn't opened up this part yet. Okay. It's got crinkles in it. Crinkles. Okay. See this? Ooh. See, it's like a long tank top and it has, it's like loose fitting. And if you look closely, I mean, it's just like, the little, it's black and has Almost like little paint splotches that could be planets or something. Let me see if it actually has a name on it. Well, this is called a Christina. That's the type of tank top it is, but it doesn't have like what the name of it is, unless this tag here does what the design is. Nope, it doesn't. Okay, so I have that one. And this next one is one, this one my friend ordered for me.
Okay, hold on. I have to bend down and pick up something. See? The silica gel pack. It says, throw away, do not eat. Hey, no guts, no glory. I watch you. I should keep these, right? If I ever get a, a vacuum sealer for food, keep these. I'll pay attention. Okay, and then this shirt is one I thought was so cute. My friend shot before I did. And she asked me, she goes, well, will that size work? And I'm going, yeah. So she got it for me. My friend is someone I babysat for when she was little. And the person who sells the LuLaRoe is her sister-in-law. But anybody who knows me, it's another Christina tank top. It's baseball. It's gray and baseball. And this one, this one is a 2X. The other one I got was a 3X because I wasn't sure exactly how they fit. Um, if they fit too big, I really don't care because of, my cats are being weird. Just because of stuff touching my skin. It's a weird thing I have. Okay, and I want to show you one last thing. Um, I've told you, I think I told you, that I've started selling Color Street nail strips. And if you want a link to my webpage, let me know. Or if you want a link to my Facebook page, let me know. If you want a free sample, let me know. These are strips of actual nail polish that you put on your nails. Um, there was something that they sold a couple years ago that, um, I don't know if they had sort of like plastic in them or something, but the, where you had to heat them to put them on. These you don't, you just put them right on your nose. These are actual dried nail polish. Look at this. See if the light, if you can see it. This is called Wanna Piece of Me. Thank you. I'm trying to see it, make sure you can see it okay. But it's tie dyed. And the way the strip comes, you can take it off the top of the strip, the bottom of the strip, or the middle of the strip. And then you just put it onto your nails. My lighting's not very good here. I know. I apologize. Um, that's one thing when I move, I am going to get a lighting thing set up. Um, that's it that I have for right now. I'm in the process, I'm trying to get some masks made, so I need to take some back to Nebraska. Some of my teacher friends need theirs. Um, I have to get some in the mail. But I'm sorry, I'm yawning. I just need to get that done. And I also need to pack. Um, if any of you are interested in the McFarland sports figures, and you want me to do um, a little video about the ones I have, because I am selling Frank's, I had set prices, but now I'm to the point where name a price, and if it's reasonable, I'll sell it. So if you're interested in that, just let me know, okay? I hope you all have a great day. Stay safe. Stay sane. Wear your mask. Don't touch your face. Get your fingers out of your nose. Wash your hands. My cats are crazy. They missed me the four days I was gone. Harper actually let me hold him last night as I fell asleep. Normally, he'll, like, wrap himself around my arm, but I was holding him as I fell asleep. Okay, you guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.